Hi guys, welcome to Full Time Devils. I'm Adam Connor. I'm with Steve from the In San Flat United of Sydney, Sheffield United 1 0. Steve, we're through in the cup. Is that all that matters today? Or do we have to look at the bigger picture and say performance is perfect? Well, I think ultimately you've got, to, you've got to say, yeah, we're through. And in previous years we haven't gone through, so that is the positive. I think what we saw was the symptom of Manchester United this entire season. We've been far too easy to defend against, and if we don't get that early goal, as we said in the live this, this afternoon, if we don't get that early goal, we, we just look like we're not going to score. Uh, teams get more and more confidence, and they think that we can kick these out here. And it, all right, yeah, it took a 95th, was it, minute penalty? Well, there was five minutes added on, and then it came like three or five. Yeah, it was it was late o'clock was what it was. So it, it, it took um, a way really penalty right at the end. It did look like Memphis went down a little bit easier. It was like he just jumped over it and then he thought, oh if I go down here, yeah. it could be a pen. So I don't know, but I'll, I'll have to see that before I went through it properly. But ultimately that's what it takes sometimes these these occasions where we haven't won a game when we should have won a game. Today, yeah, you've got to say it was a League One team, you've got to do better than that, but that's their cup final. They're a, good, they're a good cup team as well. Two teams in football in there, and that's what people forget a lot of the time. We got through, and it was... It was on a serious note, Steve. One thing I was sat there feeling, we're both the same. We want Louis Van Gaal to do, do well. We get criticised for that. Um, we, don't, we do see Louis Van Gaal's problems, his mistakes, his errors, although some would have you believe we don't know, and we blindly support him. But, today, Sitting amongst the fans, no one's having fun. No one was singing really as much as they used to. The players don't look like they're having fun. <clears throat> this is because of what's like the philosophy, isn't it? Like it's kind of drawn all the fun out of Manchester United. It might be because of that. It might be because the the recent run of results has left the players' confidence completely out of whack, and you have to put someone out on the manager. You have to put someone out on the players. It could be a multitude of things. Like there was a lot of talk going around that Ryan Giggs is training this year, this week. And we mentioned it in the live that like, Giggs is coming and he's brought boxes back into training. So we expect it to be a lot more lively in that final third. We still looked a little bit static in the final third. We're getting to that final third really well. And what we do in the final third just lacks risk, doesn't it? It's, it's very safe. And I don't know if that's all just because you can see the players trying. There's, there's just not enough movement. There's no one willing to come. A man, there's no one taking long clock shots. There's just, there's just a few things wrong in that final third, but we look really solid. The rest I've got the feeling today, like, oh, hang on, we won 4 4 2 today as well, I've also in the second half, which was good to see because I've been uh, beating that drum for a good week or so now. I would like to see us eventually move into 4 4 2. Maybe that's why we're bringing someone like Lukaku and him and Marshall. Could With a diamond, team. we did well against uh, Man City, was it last well, season? Two flat midfielders with. Schweinsteiger and Fulham, Rooney and Marshall up front. We have crosses going in that just weren't quite hitting the target. But it's encouraging to see there is a, a development happening. There is an evolution in what Lou Van Gaal is doing. Whether that's, that's it, uh, I don't know. But there, there is progress. It feels like the same old, same old. There's definitely progress. Um, I was talking to Squad Dave during the week and he was saying like, we switched formations against Swansea three times. Three at the back, four, four, two, four, three, two, three, one. So we, we've got that fluid um, adaptability in our game. We've just not got that thing in the final third. Now that might be a signing, that might be an attitude change. Like, it's very reminiscent. I mean, I barely remember it because I was like nine and ten years old, but I do remember we just couldn't score in 1992. And then Fergie brought in that French kid who turned out to be a bit decent, didn't it? It was alright, it was alright. And maybe we need a Cantonar S player where on the face of it you go, He's not that great. He's, he go, does he beat men? No, not really. Does he score like 25 goals a year? No, not really. So like, what does he do when you like, he just does it. We need a player that's just going to put that little bit of spark into the team. That little bit of confidence into the team. We need a bastard in that team. We need to, I want, I want Rooney. If Rooney was that old Rooney, one of them proper, like running around, I don't just mean running around like a headless chicken for the sake of it, but I mean like, you know, showing some leadership qualities. I think this is why I'd be back in the day, mate, was to wallop you, because it meant something to him, was that, wouldn't it? Talking about this crap again. Back in the canal room. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
<laughs> we just don't have. I thought Bastion brought an element of it. Smallin's bringing an element of it, but it doesn't look like Rooney brings anything like that. And when you saw Rooney at 19, 20 years old, when he lift you for even looking at him the wrong way, you're like, where's that player gone? And maybe it means he needs moving on. You've got to generate someone, bring someone in that can do that. But we do need that. We need that something. We're just something missing. Oh, cheers, Bastion.